Are you a small business owner who's having trouble meeting payroll? Yes, I am. The Small Business Administration can help. You might qualify for the Paycheck Protection Program, or PPP. Just follow this simple guide. Step one, go to the SBA website and see if you qualify. Sounds great. I have less than 500 employees and no discernible income. I qualify. Step two, print out the loan application form. If your printer doesn't work, try turning it off and back on again. If it still doesn't work, clear any paper jam. That's what's standing between you and government money. Forget that stupid printer. Machines need to rest too. Use this time to select a bank that will administer the loan. Choose from Bank of America, U.S. Bank, One West Bank, First Republic Bank, Chase Bank, Citibank. Congratulations! You have chosen a bank. But are you sure you want to choose Wells Fargo? Well, they were convicted of massive fraud a few years ago. Congratulations! You have chosen State Street Bank of Santa Monica. Now you are ready to enter your vital information. Vice President? What do they want? Ron, you want to be Vice President? Okay. Step 8. Determine your aggregate payroll by using the previous fiscal year's printed report. If your printer doesn't work, Try turning it off and back on again. Good work on finding a staples that was open. Thanks. Step 10. Subtract the benefits of any one individual earning over $100,000. Divide by 12. Multiply by a factor of 2.5. Why 2.5? Just for fun. These numbers don't even make sense. Step 11. It's time to guess. If you guess correctly, you may be eligible for additional funding from the Bureau of Estimates, Forecasts, and Rough Ideas. Great! So, let's say $25,000? Step 12. Make sure your figures are corroborated by Form 941. What's Form 941? If your printer doesn't work... I get it! I get it! Congratulations! You have submitted an online application. The funds for PPP have been exhausted by people who are smarter and better than you. Please try again during the next financial crisis. Ah!